Clackamas County is settling a lawsuit after a family claims that deputy pinned a 12 year old boy with his knee. Fox Hills Paulina Aguilar is at Clackamas Town Center to tell us more about what happened. Paulina. Kamar Benbow was just 12 years old when this happened. I'm going to step out of frame so you guys can see. It happened right under those trees right behind me. He was with a group of friends. He saw a fight and walked away. He was wearing a hoodie. He had some AirPods in and his mother says deputies stopped him because they racially profiled him. An unfortunate event for a boy who was just hanging out at the mall with his friends in August of 2019. I honestly don't know. I mean, being a black boy, to me is profiled. He must have been in the fight or he must know something about it. Kamar Benbow was with a group of friends when a fight broke out between two teenage girls inside the Clackamas Town Center. According to a lawsuit filed on his behalf, deputies stopped Kamar and one of them put his knee on the boy's neck, making it hard for him to breathe. A friend of Kamar's quickly called his mother, Jarena. I couldn't drive fast enough, but um, what's going through my head is that they're going to hurt my son. One, he's a little black boy. He's probably reaching for his phone because he wants to call his mom. He's scared. Um, I was I was scared that they were going to hurt him, that he was going to get shot or something. Like, I, I just knew it. And that's all that kept going through my head as I'm driving, trying to get somebody to go pick him up. But Kamar did get hurt. The lawsuit says he had bruises, cuts, and suffers long-lasting emotional damage. Jarena sued Clackamas County for $300,000. This week, they settled the case for $45,000. Clackamas County Sheriff Angela Brandenburg said in a statement, she accepts the settlement is in everyone's best interest, but that she stands by the actions of the deputies. She says they followed training and policy and that no one placed a knee on Kamar's neck. Jarena says she doesn't care about the money, and what her family really wants to see is change. There's no police reform around how they retain people. I would like that to be in play, like take it out. You can't use your knee, your shin, your anything to place a head, a neck, anything. I, I would like, I would like that to change. Just simple profiling, maybe use words first, ask a question first uh, before you assume that they're a bad person or were involved in something bad. And I would want that. Jarena says Kamar is doing okay now. He's 15 years old. He says that he wants to save that money to get an apartment when he goes off to college in just a few years. Reporting in Clackmas Town Center, I'm Paulina Aguilar, Fox 12, Oregon.